Hey, what's up? I'm Al Cox. I make games, play games, and everything in between. And today, I'm going to show you how to set up your character defeat so that the character gets removed from the game, and then your game goes to the game over UI. So let's jump to it. Here we have the character and the character just died. <laughs> Notice that the character is still there. You can still see the character when the character dies. This is not what I am going for. I would like the character to be gone. This is the game over UI. Let's take a look at the player. Here we have the player if collide with enemy debris explosion. And this is standard setup, delay node, and then game over. When the player dies, you go from here with the game over event observer, then type game over, and then that takes you to the game over screen over here. So let's do that again. Player dies, sent to the game over screen. However, we still see the player. From here, what you wanna do is you wanna use the defeat node. There is a remove node. Do not use the remove node. Do not select remove, because when you remove the character from the game, you will not be sent to the game over node because the game will still think the game is playing, but without a player. What you want is the defeat node. Use the defeat node. I have a little animation, you don't need that. And then you can see here, that the player gets removed. So the defeat node removes the player from the screen and sends you to the game over screen. So this is the process you want, is to use the defeat node, not the remove node, when the character gets defeated in the game. Well, it took me a couple times to figure out that using the defeat node on the character is always the best way to go. That's why I made this video. I've had people ask questions about the player dying but not being removed properly, and this is what you want to do. Found this video useful, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell, and if you have any things that you would like to see in Dollbox 3 or questions on how things are done, please let me know. I try to answer all my questions. Until next time, stay safe, and I will see you later.